Megan, if this is your first time here, hey girl, hey. And in today's video, as you can tell by the title, we are doing another coach bag unboxing. Now, I do do coach bag unboxings on my channel quite often, but the girl has slowed down a lot. Okay, slow down a lot. But I recently bought a new bag. Now, by no means is this a new bag to the market. It's just new to me. So if you guys are interested in checking this bag out, then please keep watching. chance to see me unboxing this bag with you all now let's just go ahead and talk a little bit about the bag now obviously as you can see I got the coach pillow tabby 18 and the shade soft gold metallic and bronze I believe that is technically the name of it um, but I picked this bag up here and I do like to just go ahead and talk about the specifics of the bag now I purchased mine through coaches reserve and I got it at a discounted price I want to say I paid like 180 or 190 with tax one of the two and um, the bag cap selling out girl I kept refreshing the screen refresh 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 somebody must have took it out of their car because as soon as they took it out I snatched it up honey and that's how I got my hands on it but it sold out really fast it sold out really fast and I think it's because the price point was just really good I believe this bag normally retails for three hundred and ninety five dollars so 180 or 190 which one I whichever one I pay is quite a significant savings for this bag and if you guys are not you know new to coach you guys know that the pillow tabbies are really really their popular bags right now so you know just a little brief i don't even know why i said that but yeah that, that's how that happened <laughs> now this bag is lined in a metallic soft calf leather and if you guys are familiar with calf leather you know it is so easy to scratch so girl you have to be really careful with this bag because any little scratch or whatever it's going to show <laughs> it is meant to be handled with delicacy just saying that so um, I do like the soft calf leather I may, I think it makes it look just very simplistic and then also a little bit of character to it because as calf leather ages you can see kind of like the lines and the indentations in it and I just think it gives the bag a lot of character but at the same time you know you just have to be really careful with it just throwing that out there now as far as the measurements on the bag is concerned it is seven and one fourth inches in the length of the bag it is four inches in the height of the bag and then two and a half inches in the width of the bag now i knew that the 18 is smaller than the sister which is the 26 but baby when i opened this i did not expect it to be this small that's just me personally like i knew it was a small bag but child it's small small okay look look at it in my hand it is small baby it's a small bag it's small <laughs> 
but um i think that it's super cute for like a girl's night out or if you're just stepping out like a really like an evening type of bag definitely you can't fit your life in here but you can get some things in there now normally i do like to do like what can fit in the bag but i'm really not gonna do that with you guys today um but as far as the inside of the bag it is lined in that soft calf leather it does have some fabric lot lining and that's just in this multi-function pocket that you get here so this part is fabricy, but the rest of the bag is leather and i kind of like that because say for instance you have your lipstick or something you just toss it in the bag it is easy to wipe out and clean so that's one of the things that i did like about the inside being lined and the leather instead of like your traditional fabric lining then also to mention it does come with a little bit of a little divider in there i did really like this as i mentioned the bag is really small so the fact that you can separate the contents of your bag i think was really smart because that way you can kind of strategically place them in your bag a little bit better in my opinion so like me for example i would take my phone and probably toss it in the front now this is the new iphone you guys the iphone 14 pro max and it does fit but baby you gotta work to get in there so i'm gonna just say that oh it could be my case but this literally took up the whole front of the bag and i i just have the back section left for like maybe my wallet my hand sanitizer maybe a lotion a little compact mirror or something but you can't get a whole lot in this bag and there is no um back slip pocket or anything like that so this is literally all you get baby so pack with caution pack with caution for real for the closure as you guys saw in the video you do have that snap closure um it's a really nice snap too because baby once you close it it's closed so i really love the um I really love the mechanism of the snap closure on it. I just feel like it makes it so easy to get in and out of your bag. The bag does come with two interchangeable straps. You get this four inch um, top handle like strap and you also get a 21 and a half inch drop shoulder strap so this is if you want to wear maybe on your shoulder or if you want to wear a crossbody style you do get the longer strap to do that and this strap is adjustable so you can get the perfect size in which you need it to be so i thought that that was really brilliant on that as well now it is really easy to change your straps out it just has a clasp on it that allows you to easily switch your bags out with just the tug of the clasp so i really love that another thing that i almost forgot to mention is this bag did come with a duster um if you guys don't know if you ever get anything through the actual coach or the coach reserve it always comes with a duster so i definitely love that i just feel like it's really important in protecting your bag so you can make sure that you're maximizing the longevity of your bag so plus for the dust bag but overall that is pretty much the gist of this bag here it is so stinking cute i'm literally obsessed with it i have not took it for a spin yet but i think a girl's night is coming up soon so she's definitely going to be coming out of the closet now i do personally want to add the 26 to my collection as well just to have the 18 and then also the 26 because i do want to wear this bag as a shoulder bag without the crossbody because baby let me tell you one thing about it this it ain't gonna cut it it's it's not gonna cut it you gonna be walking down the street like this and that's just not cute for nobody so this can't go on your shoulder with this this strap i do love this strap because it's much more expensive looking than this strap to be honest but baby it ain't going on your shoulder it's literally for your wrists or your hand <laughs> and that is it girl that's it <laughs> close the video out here if you have any questions that i did not answer in the video please feel free to ask them in the comment section down below we'll be happy to answer them for you guys and if you haven't already and you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel don't forget to do that before you leave as well thank you babes so much for watching and i will see you guys in the next one bye dolls